I'm kind of a late latecomer to the to the musician's guide as a as an author, um, but I was there at the very beginning when it first came out in 2005. At that time, in my school, uh, SUNY Fredonia, we were using um, a text that we weren't really happy with. Um, the text was fine, and, and everyone knew the text and was comfortable with that. But we we found that it was a little bit too atomistic for what we were trying to achieve. Um, our students would have this wonderful, broad uh, experience with small elements. Um, but they, in short, just weren't connecting the dots. They weren't transferring what they learned here to here. And we were looking for something that, in a way, was a little bit more grown up and, and treated them as grown ups and, and kind of expected them to make these kind of connections. Well, we reviewed uh, several textbooks. Um, we had the Musician's Guide sent to us. We had another, many others sent to us. And as a, as a group, all of our teachers, we have 12 people teaching music theory and oral skills, um, we settled on this. Um, we, we chose the music theory book for those reasons. Um, and the oral skills was a much easier sell for us, actually, because at that point, we really didn't have anything that served our purpose. We were using part of this book for dictation and part of this book for, oral, for uh, singing. Um, we didn't have anything that was piano, so we were making up our own piano exercises. Um, the mus Musician's Guide came along, um, and it was really one-stop shopping. It was everything that we needed. So in that sense, it was an easy sell. Um, I was asked by Mary Beth Payne to, to review the text for the editors, since um, we now had experience with it. So I did that and wrote, I think, maybe too much. I, I wrote <laughs> quite a bit of comments, um, what I thought was, was wonderful and what I thought I still would like. When the time for the second edition came along, um, I was asked to be part of the team uh, because I was very familiar with the, with the pedagogy and my pedagogy seemed to fit with the book really well. Um, I had to think about it for about five minutes and then I decided, yes, I really do want to be part of this team.